Today we're opening a Retro Pack 2 Blister. What's up guys, we're back with another epic video. Today we're opening a Retro Pack 2 Blister Pack. It has three packs and the Green Baboon, as well as some Ghosts from the Past Packs. We're hoping to get a Dark Magician. But first we have a giveaway. I'll be giving away a Parasite, Parasite, Monster, Renacido, Foreign Monster Reborn, and an Ultimate Rare, Dark Lucius, Level 6. All you have to do is like this video, be subscribed, let me know what you want to see from the opening, and what do you think we'll pull. Alright guys, this is not going to be a super long video, but we have some banger packs that we're going to be opening. We could pull the Blue Eyes Shining Dragon Secret Rare. I'd be happy with any Secret Rare out of here, because there's some really good ones. Jinzo comes as an Ultra Rare in here as well. You guys know Blue Eyes Shining was one of the biggest pulls on our channel, so that'd be really cool. Flashback. This one is going to be one of our best yet, the 20,000 subscriber special. We're opening some of the rarest packs in Yu-Gi-Oh. Let's go to Retro Pack 2. So not not the LOB, you know, foil off of the bang star that I was hoping for, but that's okay. Oh, we've got um, Spirit Message in. Oh, wow. Okay. Spirit Message in. Can we pull something? Oh, Book of Moon, guys. This Book of Moon's been printed so many times, but Retro Pack 1 is the most valuable version so that's pretty cool skull invitation kaiku the ghost destroyer it's a nice common yes no way oh my god it's not the blue eyes from the lob but it's as good as you're gonna get end of flashback and of course, Dragon Master, Knight, Harpy's Pet Dragon, some ones that we have not pulled yet. And then we have some Ghosts from the Past, which we have not opened a lot recently, and we're just trying to get hyped up for Ghosts from the Past 2. If you guys have not heard about Ghosts from the Past 2, the Ghost Rares are crazy. We don't know a lot about the rest of the set, but right now the Ghost Rares are going to be really awesome, which is super exciting. And I'm going to, there's a Genius, which used to be like eight bucks, now it's like a dollar. I'm going to be going crazy on that set. We're going to be opening a lot of it in April. I think it's April, I forgot already, the 20 something or something like that. So that it's not a March reprint set anymore. They moved it to April like it was last year when it got delayed. So hopefully they will come out on time this year and we can pull some amazing ghost rares like the SDK Blue Eyes, Dark Magician Girl, the Cyber Dragon, Dark Arm Dragon, and uh, what's the other one? Uh, oh, Red Dragon Archfiend. Let's RDA. Let's not forget that one. Got to give it the respect it deserves. It finally got a ghost share after being in the Duelist Genesis and ult Ultimate, I should say, and an Ultra, and uh, no ghost rare. So it didn't get a ghost rare until now. Sunvine Healer. We got the Time Thief Startup. There will be four more ghost rares as well, apparently. Arm Dragon, level 10. Okay. Okay, let's go ahead and open this blister. We're going to do a, a pack or so at a time. We have three packs. It's going to hurt a little bit to open this because this thing is actually in good condition, but you guys know how we roll. We got to open some big stuff. Let's do this without damaging anything. Okay, we got our green baboon out. It looks like it's in... Is it is it bent at all? Because normally these are kind of bent. It's a little bit bent because they've been, they're in this weird plastic in there. It's very easy to get bent, but this one actually looks pretty nice. It might actually be able to easily be flattened out. I mean, other than that, it looks minty. So that, we actually hit a nice one. This is not a very expensive card, but it's kind of hard to get them in nice condition now because if you open one of those, they're usually like bent up or something. So pretty cool. Let's open one retro pack too. Then we're going to go back to Ghost from the Past. You know, we don't want to have like a two minute video. So I wanted to throw in some Ghost Rare packs. Here we go. First pack of Retro Pack 2. You guys know I love this set. We have Kaiku, the Ghost Destroyer. The Gravity Binds. Make sure we're recording before we, you know, we do anything. Call of the Haunted. We have pulled what? Two Secret Rares? Out? No, three Secret Rares. We've pulled the Blue Eyes Shining Dragon, pulled Archfiend of Gilfer. Is that what he's called? And then the Green Baboon Unlimited with Ryan Style, which was pretty awesome. Uh, Legendary Ocean, which I put in the uh, top two moments because we had... Oh, upside down. Not only that, but we had the uh, Exodia Head. So let's see freed okay uh we're going upside down so it looks like maybe this is the only upside down one okay that's not a rare oh wait no that's the rare freed oh i didn't notice because it's upside down okay unfortunately it is a freed it's only a nine card pack it's not like dark beginning so there's not extra packs kaiku is actually probably worth a couple bucks so we're gonna pull that out okay first retro pack two was a dud but we do have two more maybe we could pull the legendary ghost rare you guys know it's like one out of 150 packs or something in this set so pretty unlikely that we will get it but you never know that's why you open the packs hieratic seal and evenly matched the best card that's not a ghost rare in the set which is kind of sad because it's only like 12 bucks uh yeah it's there's not a lot of good cards in ghost from the past one that's what we're hoping for ghost from the past two that there's some nice you know Cards that are not ghost rares, because if there's not cards that are not ghost rares that are nice, so like some ultra rares, because it's an all ultra rare set besides the ghost, that can hold up the value as well. This set is going to be crazy good. I'm really excited. Cosmojo. You should probably buy it ahead of time before it actually gets released, because it's going to get hyped up. Starry Night, Flamel. I mean, with the, just imagine. Ghost rare, Dark Magician, Girl, Blue Eyes, all that stuff. People are going to be buying that like crazy. I mean, it's going to... If you thought scalping was bad before, just, just wait. So I would advise buying it ahead of time, um, so you guys can get something. So we've got the Time Thief White... Winder is that what it's called. Dragoonity Phalanx. 
Mass Change. Love that card. Royal Prison. I'm sure a lot of people do not. Okay, here we go. Ooh, Dragoonie Knight. Aribdhair. I still don't know how to say that name, and I will continue to say it wrong probably. All right. Ghost from the Past. Again. I still do have some of these packs, though, because even though the set was not incredible, just pulling those epic ghost rares like Dark Magician, Blue Eyes Alternative are really awesome. And I think the people that are always trash talking the set, talking about how, uh, you know, the ghost rares are awful, but they're really not, and they're pretty good. Hieratic Sky Dragon Overlord of Heloplomus. A couple more of these, then we're going to go back to Retro Pack 2. I'm pretty excited. I'm hoping we can get something. There's a high chance we don't pull anything, but that small chance is why we're opening this. Mass Change. Madolce, fresh to start. Gear down. And. Ooh, Shooting Star Dragon TGEX. I have been playing the TG deck a little bit in Duel Links. Uh, it's it's a little bit, it's a synchro deck, so it kind of makes sense, but not super great with it yet, but you know, you just got to learn all that stuff. Hieratic Dragon, Time Thief Redoer, hate this card. <laughs> Danger Thunderbird, and Starry Knight Raya. One final ghost from the past, and then we will go retro pack two again. I'm really excited. I'm nervous. I'm nervous. Backup secretary. Metaphol's gold driver. Time thief flyback. These names are a little shifted. Laval volcano handmaiden and starry night arrival. Back to retro pack two. What retro cards will we pull this time? Come on, let's pull something fire. We did pull the blue eyes ultra or the. Blue Eyes, whatchamacallit, well, not Alternative, Shining Dragon, out of one of these blisters, too. So we didn't think at the time that it was possible, but it is. Maybe I'll flash back to that pull at some point in this so you guys can... If you guys are a new viewer, maybe you have not seen that video somehow. It was awesome. Curse of the Mass Beast. Skull Invitation, very cool. Premature Burial. Okay, wait, wait, let's, let's do it like this. We don't want to ruin it too early. Let's go like this. Mask of Restraint. This is, like, actually a great common. We've got an Opti Clops. Okay, I, I hit the, the mouse. We're not we're still recording because I stopped recording the other day. That was messed up. Opti Clops. Parasite Parasite. Bazoo the Soul Eater. This is probably a good one too. Just a lot of retro cards in here. There's the premature. Okay, after this is where it could be, guys. Let's see. It's a trap. Could be uh ring of destruction, I think, is a secret rare in here. It's a chain destruction. So we're close, but it's a regular rare, not a foil. Okay. Chain Destruction, not too exciting. All right, we still got one more chance there. One more chance there. We got a few more chances here with the ghosts. Let's see if we can do it. Fairy Tale Tail, Starry Night Blast, Hieratic Dragon, King of the Tome, Time Thief Redoer, and Time Thief Double Barrel. Next pack, Ghost from the Past. Let's do this. Danger Thunderbird. Give us some luck. Let's pull a Ghoster, and that'll give us, you know, the momentum to pull something in Retro Pack 2. Miracle Synchro Fusion. Madolce Chateau. All right, focus in there. Higher Attic, Sky Dragon Overlord of Hillablom. <laughs> yeah, that. All right. Come on. Give us some good ghosts from the past. This is what we're hoping to is better, because you're supposed to have a better chance to pull a ghost rare. So let's see. We got the uh, Draco Aquist, Time Thief, Perpetua, and Dragoonity Legatus. I think this is an okay one. Dragoonities are not great, though. So the talk with Ghost from the Past 2 is that it's going to be twice as easy to pull a Ghost, but in in reality, the specific Ghosts are going to be about the same because there's, you know, twice as many Ghosts. Almost there's nine instead of five. Not quite twice, but... So if that's actually true, then you will pull two per case, hopefully, which would be a lot easier than one per case and hopefully uh, more exciting. Tackle Crusader, and I'm hoping that's the truth. And... Dragoonity Remus. This was the big hit of the uh, the original opening back when it first came out. It was like 20 bucks. Fell down to like four. So unfortunately, that is no longer the money card. And our final ghost from the past. Give us luck here so that we can open something epic and retro pack two. We have a Buster Dragon. We got the Mist Valley Baby Rock. The Monarchs Erupt. Cool. Sun Avalon Dryas. And... Orchestrated return. Okay. Our final pack of the opening. Retro pack two. Here we go. Retro pack two has been pretty epic for us in the past. Can it be epic for us now? Skull invitation again, just like last time. Okay, let, let's do the little pack trick. I don't normally do this, but it's fun to do it on some of the big packs. It's upside down again. Does that mean it's a rare? Hopefully not. Okay, bottomless trapple. Pretty good card. Good start. We got a dust tornado. Another pretty good card. Dark Spirit of the Silent. This comes in the black letter rare. It's a misprint in uh, LON, which is cool. It's a super rare. Gravekeeper's Chief. Another cool card. Not too valuable, I don't think. 
Skull Invitation, we already saw this one. Premature Burial, another good card. Just a lot of good commons in here. Spirit... Oh, no. Oh, no, it's a sign, guys. Spirit Message L, it's already telling us, you took an L. Hopefully, it's wrong. Hopefully, it's lying to us. Spirit Message N. Yeah, it's an N for not... That doesn't stand for lie. Okay. Um, is this it? Is this the last card? Oh, it's upside down. Oh, no. Let's see. 1800 that is not that does not seem promising Geoffrey the Iron Knight just a regular rare all right unfortunately we did not pull anything amazing but it's always fun to open those retro pack two packs you guys know I love them if you guys enjoyed the video and the old school opening hit that like button subscribe for more epic content because it's coming up in the future shout out to TCG trusted card tomato juice Noah J Stanley Mike Nance Mimic Gecko Duelist Kingdom cards and Spanky McFarlane thank you guys for supporting the channel and I'll see you guys in the next one peace